Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a kids haul um, for clothes and bits for back to school. I actually got quite a lot of things from H&M. We just got our parcel today, um, H&M Kids. And then I also got some things from Tesco. They have this, um, what's it called? FNF clothing. I think that's the uh, brand that's in the Tesco stores. So I actually liked quite a few things in there. Um, I did get most of the bits from H&M, which I usually um, shop at for kids. Yeah, but I found quite a lot of things in H&M, so I'm gonna go through them and show you what I picked. Now, um, if you guys have watched my previous like toddler capsule wardrobes, then you will know I usually go for very neutral colors because I just really like those. Um, I feel like they're really easy to put together, like to combine in outfits. Um, but this time I actually did a little bit different. I mean, they are still quite neutral. It's not like it's very out there. But when I went into um, Tesco's to buy things for uh, Victor, I actually took him with me and he really enjoyed that. And it made me think of um, like the times when I used to go with my mom um, or my dad to get the back to school bits, like notebooks and things like that. And I would always get so excited. So he really enjoyed it too. And he actually picked quite a lot of things himself. So even though it wasn't necessarily what I would pick or my taste, I let him pick his own things because I know then he's gonna be more likely to get dressed in the morning without the fight. Um, and you know, he's just gonna feel more confident if it's things that he actually likes to wear. Um, so I feel like I kind of went more on his um, taste than mine this time around. Um, so when I picked clothes, I actually tried to be mindful of that because, for example, I think in my previous haul or maybe two hauls ago, I bought him a um, like sweatshirt and trousers set with a teddy bear on it. So it was like a beige color with a teddy bear on it. And he does not want to wear that. Like, it's very rare that he will like to wear that. So I figured this time I'm just going to go with things that I know he's going to like. So things with a bit more color. First thing that I picked, I'm going to show you, is a set from H&M. So it comes with sweater and trousers how cute and these are um, like thick knitwear I mean it's not super thick it's more like a fine knitwear I would say but it's really lovely um, so this is the um, sweater that it comes with super cute it's green obviously um, and I got everything in two to three years old if you guys are interested in prices for any of these items I will um, leave links to the H&M website down below like to all of the items so that you can check the prices yep I'm gonna link them all below so this is the um, sweater and then it comes with these trousers so cute they're also that knitwear fabric really lovely he has something very similar but I think it's finer than this in like a brown shade and he really likes wearing that and I think it looks so cute on him so I figured I would get some green like a green set as well I think he will like that he really likes color green at the moment yeah so that's the first thing that I picked um, then he actually starts nursery next week um, I mean when you are watching this he's actually starting uh, settling in sessions it's like preschool slash nursery um, and he's gonna have three settling in sessions and then next week he starts you know like proper um, going on his own without me there so I figured I need quite a lot of uh, basics for him to go to nursery um, in and I kind of want to have I'm not sure if I'm gonna succeed in this but I'm gonna give it a go I my in my mind I want to have kind of like a separate wardrobe for the things that he goes in um, at nursery and then just the rest of the things that he can wear at home um, or when we go out and about because um, he's gonna need you know quite a lot and I obviously need to pack um, like a change or two of clothes in his backpack when he goes to nursery just in case there's accidents or they get food on them or whatever so I just wanted to stock up on some basics so I got a pack of three trousers these were in a set it's one gray pair of joggers just really simple um, and it's kind of a thin fabric because if they're inside at nursery it's usually quite warm um, especially um, during the like colder months when they actually turn on the heat so I wanted him to have some um, really good basics to wear in there and these are all two to three years old I think that's what I picked most things um, as far as size goes then it comes with a navy one again very simple just basic joggers um, and then it also comes in a set with this black pair so really cute, you got grey, navy and black, really good basics and he actually doesn't mind wearing these. Oh, I feel like the lighting keeps going 
all over the place so i apologize for that it's actually quite late when i'm filming this then i got him another set of trousers i believe these came in a set i can't remember exactly i'm gonna have to check on the website but i will link it down below but i believe these two came in a set as well so um the main reason why i picked this set is because he loves dinosaurs and i know he's gonna love wearing these so it's a pair of trousers all dinosaurs so it's like jogger bottoms as well really cute he's gonna love this they come in a set with a pair of these like lighter blue joggers so so cute um, and they're really good basics again just to kind of pair up with lots of things so I believe those are all the bottoms that I picked for him and then to go with those I got um, a set of long sleeve shirts like tops um, and again they come in a set of three and these are always reasonably priced I find if you get packs of things in H&M they're quite good price so um, again got navy one just very simple long sleeve really perfect for preschool slash nursery so it comes with navy gray again really simple one and then it, this one comes with a white as well so very basic um, but i think you will like wearing those and then i also got a set of um, sweatshirts and one of them is actually in my toddler's room um, he wore it today uh, but it came with a set it's this one it's like a brown camely color really cute sweatshirt um, and it's got a big pocket down the front which he actually really likes he likes that he can put little things in there kind of collect stones so it, the set comes with this one and then it comes with another sweatshirt just like this but it's got this print the dinosaur one so it kind of matches with these trousers so <laughs> he loved that he made me put it on the second that we opened the parcel i knew he would like that um sweatshirt really he was a really big fan of this haul um he wasn't sure about this one though um i got him one kind of neutral color and he was like oh this one's for mommy <laughs> so i'm not sure if i'm gonna get him to wear this but um i liked it so i um yeah i'm gonna give it a go i'm gonna show you in a second what i got from tesco kids but this was also in my h&m haul so i got this plate for him how cute is this it's like a rainbow plate i actually wish it was plastic instead of porcelain because obviously he might he might break it to be honest um i thought it was plastic i didn't check but you know it's fine hopefully it lasts um because i think it's so cute and i also got him this cup so cute again it's got the rainbow on it so so lovely and it's got polka dots on the back and inside it says let's chase rainbows how cute is that so really lovely set for him to eat his meals on i actually need to get him a few more plates because um a couple of him um like the ones that we've had for quite a long time have cracked like they, they were plastic but i think maybe i put food that was too hot on it and they just cracked which is really weird but oh well <laughs> so i need to get him some more plates um but also from h&m i got a pack of two tea towels so so cute i really liked the pattern it's kind of minimalist it's got kind of stripes lines I'm not sure if you can tell yeah i think you can tell so one of them is kind of an off-white color like this and then the other one is more like a grayish but this is the this is the fabric and it says enjoy the simple things in life <laughs> so cute yeah both of them both of them have that i was really liking some new tea towels because my old ones are absolutely destroyed so i have to replace them okay moving on to tesco i mean fnf clothing in tesco so first thing that i wanted to get him is some new trainers um these ones i picked for his preschool nursery um so i um, he actually really liked these obviously because they have dinosaurs on them i'm not sure if you can tell um so really simple like tennis shoes um, I really like that it's velcro so it's really easy to put on and I also got him another pair of trainers which actually he picked so they're um, simple blue I'll, I'll try to insert a picture here so you can see but um, yeah I got him two pairs of um, new trainers because the, honestly he ruins trainers like there's no tomorrow like they just they just get ruined so fast um, or he outgrows them so i feel like they never last too long um let me know if you're a boy mom if you find the same i mean even trousers i, I a lot of them have holes either in the um, knees or the bottom i don't know he just plays around at the playground and he's 
so wild <laughs> he gets them ruined so fast um but yeah got him new trainers um, and I believe now for the Tesco bits, I don't have prices on them. Um, so I have no idea how much they were. I believe the trainers were around eight, 10 pounds. Um, next, I picked up some PJs for him. They actually didn't have loads in his size, uh, but they had these ones. Now he's not really a fan of Toy Story. I don't think he's ever watched Toy Story yet, um, but he really liked them for some reason. So this is what he picked. So it's. Uh, PJs just simple long sleeve because we are going into winter um, I mean autumn winter and it comes with bottoms but yeah really cute so it comes it's like a set it comes with two so it's this one and then it's this one as well how cute is that it's gray and it's got it's got Toy Story on it and then these are the bottoms as well I just thought this was really cute and he obviously he picked them so he really liked them too next up socks and underwear which we really needed um, a new set just to kind of have extra because I feel like we're constantly doing laundry just to kind of have more uh, because he goes through them so fast uh, but the, let me know if you guys are surprised by what he picked so I'll show you it's a set of five socks and this is what one of them looks like <laughs> It's got five, no, this is a bus on it, bus socks, and then all of them have different vehicles. So this one's got, I think, a digger on it. Obviously not what I would have picked, but I really like how he was really into um, picking things on his own. So I really wanted to encourage that and, you know, kind of let him do his thing and pick what he likes. And he was so excited to um, get these. So this one's got fire engine on and then I and I like that they're quite long at the top because um, obviously since it's getting a little bit cold he's gonna need them to be a bit longer just to keep him warm and this one's got a police car and I think he has another one like a green pair in his room because I can't find them right now and he also picked uh, we got a set of 10 um, pieces of underwear <laughs> I'm just gonna show you the bunch of them because they're really colorful so he picked all the colorful ones. So that's pretty much my haul for back to school. I mean, I kind of had back to school in mind for most of these things. Um, and it's just a few things that we were lacking or needing more of. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know if your little ones have started school yet or what the situation is like for you this year. Um, Victor is, as I said, he's starting preschool nursery next week. So it's kind of exciting. He's really excited to go back. I'm a bit nervous about the settling in, but I think he's gonna do fine. He was always fine when he used to go to nursery. We'll see how it goes, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.